Hey guys, how's it going? It is grocery haul time. Now guys, first thing I am going to say is I got my new computer and it has got completely different editing software than what I am used to using. So I greatly appreciate everybody who is bearing with me during this transition. The last video I uploaded was using it. Um, I have not figured out how to do the little clip at the end. Um, where I thank everybody for watching. Um, I've not figured out how to add audio to so the music. It, it's a learning curve, so please bear with me for just a little longer. Um, I, I asked the guy at Best Buy to help make sure that I got something that was, you know, uh, basically click, use, easy for someone who's never used it before, and he said this one was. Um, so either he was wrong or I'm that much farther behind than I realized. I don't know. Anyhow, guys, either way, I have good groceries here. I'm gonna run through this. I'll run through totals at the end. This week does look a little different. We did not do any order pickups. We actually physically ran, to, I shouldn't say no order pickups. We did uh, place an order through Target and did their drive up. That is no different than any other time though. And we did go into Sam's Club and then Sean took a couple of the teens and they ran into Safeway to get produce and almond milk. Um, and the almond milk's a funny story. I, I knew it seemed like we were really low for some reason and that was weird. Middle of the week, Sean found two jugs in the back of his van that got missed. And of course they were bad by that point. So there is that. Anyhow guys, let me run through this. I'll run through totals and anything else at the end. All right, guys, here is what we have this week. Starting down in this end, um, I saw these veggie puffs, they're sour cream and onion at Sa uh, Sam's Club. And you know, the kids are hit or miss with the veggie straws. They either like them or they don't, just depending on their moods. I think if anything, they like them because they can blow through them. But if your kids like uh, cheddar puffs or anything like that, I'm really tempted to see if this is going, or I shouldn't say I'm tempted, I am going to see if this is a better alternative for that. Um, I cannot eat them because they are still very, very corn based. So there is that. Um, while I ran across the store for something else, uh, Sean picked up these baked chips and some barbecue chips. The target order pretty much consisted of these four boxes of apple cinnamon checks. Guys, I have to assume that this is a seasonal flavor because it's fall. Uh, we're getting close to fall. At the same time, it doesn't say seasonal, so I'm really hoping this will stick around because several of us have found we really like it. But we also know that the blueberry did not stick around. So I suggest you guys go ahead and get some so that you can try it um, because I can't promise whether or not you'd miss out on that. And then the other thing from Target were those three bottles of Sir Kensington's Classic Mayonnaise. Um, it's just really good taste and quality. They do use eggs in it. So our egg allergy kiddo cannot have that. Um, from Safeway, we got two jugs of almond milk, pretty much to replace the two that uh, were left in the back of his van this last week. We've got four bunches of bananas. They picked up two bags of grapes and one large bag of apples. I guess I didn't even look. Looks like they're Fuji apples, yum. The, all of the produce and the almond milk came from Safeway. And then back here, the rest of the stuff from Sam's today, uh, we intended to get the Cheez-Its. And then while in the snack aisle, Sean spotted the Little Bites. And our poor kiddo with braces, you know, we bought all this stuff when she got just the top rack, but, uh, and then decided we didn't care for having this kind of stuff around so much. And then I realized how mean it was that we got that stuff when she had just the top rack for her braces. Now she's got top, bottom, high racks, and herbs appliance. So now is actually when it makes more sense for her to have something that's really easy to eat, even if I don't care for buying the product too often. Anyhow, so we got more of those for now. Won't be for crazy long, but we've got them. Um, our youngest has a massive thing for pretzels, and these Halloween pretzels are really kind of perfect because they're individual snack size bags instead of the giant tub where he wants to eat directly out of the tub, which then nobody wants to eat after him. So um, this is actually really great for snacks for that reason. Uh, we've got this thing of brewed tea. It's unsweetened. Sean decided to start trying to switch over to the unsweetened tea from the regular sweet tea he's been drinking lately. 
We are moving towards fall with school starting, even though we homeschool, if we have any school age foster kiddos, um, you know, it's just, it's good sometimes to have the extra immune stuff to have here in the house because kids have a way of bringing stuff home. Uh, we have two cases of water bottles because we just needed more of that. And then uh, we've kind of gotten out of our kick of pineapple juice lately, but Sean spotted this um, flat of, it's got 24 eight ounce cans of pineapple juice and decided to go ahead and get it and see if the two of us get back into drinking that a little bit more again, help with digestion and stuff like that. So guys, that is all we got this week. Let me go ahead, I'm gonna get this stuff put away, flip it, and I'll tell you all about those totals. Okay guys, so while the kids are finishing putting everything away, I'm gonna run through those totals really quick. Now, like I said, we did not do the grocery pickup today. Um, for one, we just did not have that much we needed and I had a really hard time justifying placing the orders when we could easily run in for just those couple things. Um, at the same time, Walmart has a minimum order of $35. So I knew I wasn't gonna buy enough to be able to place that order. Target doesn't require that. Um, I wasn't gonna get the mayonnaise originally, but it was already in my cart so I wouldn't forget it. So I went ahead and got that. Uh, the checks was planned, but here's what happened, guys. So we knew we needed produce, and beyond that, this week was going to be a very slim week. Uh, we just don't need a lot. And besides that, I wanted to run things down just a little bit more between trips because I am planning a video to show you guys part of how I prep for our groceries. Chip eggs are noisy. <laughs> um, I wanna show you guys just exactly how I prep uh, for our grocery shopping, how I write out my grocery list and all of that. And to do so, I need to not have too much on hand already so it's a little bit easier to show you guys. But here's the other thing, guys. Um, Sean and I going into Sam's Club today, we went in there for four things. We planned to get the Cheez-Its, we planned to get the water, we planned to get the tea, and Actually, I think that was it. I, I swear we kept saying there were four things, but that's what we went in there for. That is not what we came out with. Um, you're good. <laughs> They're moving the cases of water and stuff and it gets a little noisy. Um, and all of those extra little things, when you purchase them, they really add up. So, you know, $20 for the emergency. I don't even, I'll have to double check prices for the pineapple juice and the bags of chips and all of that stuff. Guys, it just, it just adds up. Um, and then three boxes of Little Bites, none of that was planned for. So, I can't be too surprised when I just added everything up and we are sitting at $256.72. Yes, it's under budget, um, so I can be thankful for that, but we're only under budget by $44. Well, actually a little under because of the change. So, $43 and change then. Not quite what I thought we would be under considering, oh, I know why I was thinking for, because the biggest thing we needed was the apple cinnamon checks, the water, the tea, and the um, cheese it crackers. Uh, that's it, that's all we needed today. And some, well, no, I say that because then there was fruit. So either way, Guys, I am tired and I am scrambled today and the kids are putting stuff away for me and it's really appreciated. So I'm gonna go ahead, help up, help with the last little bit of it and all of that. If you guys have any questions or comments, leave it down in the comment section below. And I'm gonna go ahead and get working on those other videos. I am trying to work through the laptop. I won't even call it issues because they're not issues. It's just a learning curve. I just have to figure out how to use this software and that's another thing I am so thankful to YouTube for because there are so many great creators who have put up how-to videos of varying levels. Some of them are a little more explanatory than others. Um, you know, it's there's people like myself who I don't have a background in some of this stuff so I need somebody to break it down to the base level for me. Don't teach it as if I should already know some of this stuff. So that's what I'm working on. I'm gonna get all of that done see how this video turns out if i can't get that figured out in order to get this up here for you guys monday morning i will just transfer this to my phone so if you hear the regular music and everything else it's because that's what i use this time around and by the following week 
it will be done from the new laptop. Anyhow, guys, I hope that you're having a blessed day. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss everything else coming up next. And I'll see you in the next one.